Hello. Today, we're going to drink straight liquor. That ought to get me proper drunk. We're going to start off with some scotch. Scotch is whiskey from Scotland. To be called scotch, it needs to be aged at least three years. This is Glenfiddich, which is aged 12 years. This particular one, single malt. To be called single malt, it's just barley. And it's the only grain they're using in the whiskey process. One thing that differentiates scotch from anything else, they use peat whiskey uh, in the process. Basically, when the barley's germinating, they stop that germination process by heating it up and the fuel they burn is peat moss which gives it a distinct flavor and the end result how much peat they use will, will change the flavor of the whiskey i think glenfiddich is a little lighter peated than some other scotches and it's one of my favorites uh this this being the 12. all these bottles are around 40 dollars i tried to do a little comparison there so let's try our scotch Yeah, it's it's so smooth. It's really good whiskey. You know, it's only what forty percent, forty percent alcohol by volume. So it's not uh, you know as much alcohol as a lot of your bourbons are going to be, uh, which you know also helps it be smooth. But you get a hint of the peat, not too much peat. Scotch is a great go-to. It's delicious. I think this particular one, specifically, and in, in, you know where I buy in Ohio, this is a forty-five dollar bottle. Now let's move on to cognac. Cognac is a brandy. Brandy is a distilled wine. Also, I think 40% alcohol. Brandy's or cognac is brandy from uh, you know particular region, cognac region of France. What's the name cognac? Uh, cognac is going to be aged in a uh, French oak barrel. I believe it also has to be aged a minimum of two years. This is VSOP, so very superior, old pale. And to have that moniker, it's got to be aged a minimum of four years. It's a blended cognac. The youngest brandy in here is going to be at least four years old. Uh, but it's a good product as well. This, this is around $40. I believe I paid $40 for this bottle. And uh, traditionally, cognacs drink out of a giant snifter. Yeah, I mean, also smooth, but it's got a completely different flavor profile than the whiskeys. You taste fruit. I mean, it's, you know, obviously derives from grapes, but you don't necessarily, I can't tell you, yeah, it's a grape, but I can tell you it's got a fruit taste to it. It's also very smooth and, you know, does the job. All right, so that's our cognac, our brandy. And last but certainly not least, we got our bourbon. The best thing about bourbon is it's American. It's gotta be made in America. It's gotta be made of at least half corn. Uh, the majority of it has to be corn, so it's gonna be more than half, 51% corn minimum. Uh, the other grains they're gonna use in the mash bill are like wheat, rye, barley. Uh, but but it's got to be predominantly corn. So you know, scotch was was barley for the single malt, and uh, bourbon's going to be mostly corn. This is also aged ten years bullet bourbon. I think this is forty two dollars around here. And uh, I don't know what else there is. They also aged minimum of two years to be a, a straight bourbon. It's got to be a minimum age of two years in a newly charred oak barrel. So all of them are in oak barrels. One of them is French. Uh, this one obviously aged 10 years, but this bourbon. Yeah. This is a high rye bourbon, so it's got like a, a spiciness to it, like a black pepper taste to it just a little bit. 
Let's give it a little bit of a different taste. Predominantly taste the burnt wood, which paired with alcohol, that's a delicious flavor. Oh, there you have it. Three straight liquors. I already feel the first one. That ought to get me proper drunk. Those three together. You know, they all go great with a cigar. Yeah, can't say enough good things about bourbon, scotch, and cognac. Alright, hope you enjoy my videos. Uh, if you do like them, you can subscribe. Uh, I tried out a, a little bit of a title video scene towards the beginning. Hope you like that. Other than that, have a good day. Thank you.